Ahoy, and uh, welcome to Adland TV. Uh, so today we're looking at the mercenary set, uh, as I've got the figurehead to finally complete the set. There is there. Uh, I have checked, the eyes do glow in the dark. Uh, so basically to get the hull and the sails and the flag, you have to complete the Friends Play for Free. Uh, event back in the start of February and obviously the figurehead comes with the, the current black powder stashes let's have a look around here, so let's have a quick look around here so let's see there's the figurehead, we already had a look at it under, underneath uh, there is colouring down on the, the deck of the ship here you see it's red and dark green throughout as you can see there with the cannon dark green base uh, colour to the mast there's the helm, there's the cat stand. The sail for this I think is a bit, you know, a bit bland really, just having the white with the scorpion on it. It's much better when you get to the larger ship types. Here it's just a case of the trimming is green, but nothing else is painted. Uh, the cross beams again are green. A uh, new, new thing for this. You hear me mention in the brigantine that I forgot to mention this. Well, I had, but I had to re-record this bit, so I thought I'd show you now. A little bit of extra protection from cannon shots. But obviously, when they're down, any bailing will have to be done out there. And that bucket doesn't look right, but anyway, I digress. So that is a look at the sloop, uh, so now we're going to go and move on to the brigantine. Okay, and here we are looking at the brigantine. Somehow locked out in the same outpost as I was with the sloop, but never mind. Uh, so here we are looking at it. I do like the black and red half sail, sort of diagonally split sail. It's a problem with the sloop, you just get stuck with the one with the scorpion on it. And it's a nice, nice looking figurehead. Sure, at night those glowing eyes look menacing, but I haven't actually uh, either had someone come at me with it or done the same myself. So, but anyway, I digress. So here we are, looking nice. I say there's a colouring around the, the uh, helm area. So always nicer with the newer sets, coloured masts. Looks like the sun has just risen, so some of it is still looking a little dark. Trust me, these bases are that dark green colour. Same with the capstan. So let's have a look down here. And once again, this always seems to be the way with the brigantine. No colouring. One thing that if anyone wasn't aware, they've got these new hatches. It's also on the sloop. Um, but I always forget about the ones on the sleep. <laughs> I'm honest. But anyway, so that's a look at the brigantine. Like I said, it's uh, nice looking sails. Quite imposing. Right. So let's have one last look around. Nothing out there. Nice galley ship, never mind. Well, anyway, so that's going to be the brigantine. Let's move on and have a look at the galleon. Okay, finally, here we are looking at the galleon. Uh, so, as you can see, that figure here does look even more imposing on a galleon. I think the green also stands out a little more. So, it might just be that we're now in the height of the day. But I've always thought the green sort of stands out a little more. And as you can see, like the base of the cannons there, you can definitely see the green on them now. Okay, here we are, green then. Let's see the mast. That's the capstan. That helm, even. That's the capstan. And down here, uh, apart from like the. Uh, support struts. Everything else is quite plain. Ooh. 
So that is the mercenary set there. Nothing really further to show you. Hopefully they will at some point bring out individualised cannons and helms and capstans. But for the time being, uh, this is it. So if you have enjoyed the video, please do uh, like and share. As this really does help the uh, channel grow. Subscribe if you're new. Um, and I'll catch you on the next one.